members of the public i am so happy to shoot this video because i have one or two messages to pass across to you this is very important please let us not take it for granted why because so many things are happening in our generation today we don't know what is the cause i've heard about a child killing his father i've heard about mother killing his daughter her daughter and parents using their children for ritual what do we think is the cause of all this we cannot really explain but this is time for us to think deeply and let's go into a biblical aspect of this for those of us that, that we are familiar with our bible the book of matthew john and revelation tell us things about the end time yes i've heard about fake pastors i've heard about fake prophets the bible says many false prophets shall arise and many shall be led astray even the chosen one will be led astray my brother my sister i want us to be wise i want us to stand up mind inside of us let's use the original spirit of god in us to worship god let us not be among those that will be tools in the hands of the wicked ones let us be a generational impact let us stand and spread this gospel let us stand and share these words to our brothers and sisters it doesn't matter what you are doing it doesn't matter if you're a criminal it doesn't matter if you're a ritualist it doesn't matter whoever you are but the time is now say no to those sins you have committed turn your back to the devil come to jesus for he is the lord and personal savior of you and i let's come to him let's believe in him and he will give us another chance so to be a great pleasure for you to pray this prayer with me and heaven will rejoice over it close your eyes say lord jesus i am a sinner come into my heart make me a new person from today i have decided to follow you i have decided to say no to the devil forward ever and backward never I confess you, Jesus, as my Lord and personal Savior. Thank you, Father, for in Jesus' name I have prayed. Amen and amen. Congratulations. Today you are a new creation. Heaven and I are rejoicing over you. The advice I have to tell you is that read your Bible. Read your Bible. Avoid evil company, evil communication. Just like the way the Bible says, evil communication corrupt good manners. Let's come closer to Jesus Christ. Let's make him our Lord and personal Savior. Let's get rid of evil friends. Those friends you have before, go back to them. Tell them today you are, you are born again. You belong to Christ. You are for Jesus. Never for anybody. Congratulations. God bless you. And bye-bye for now.